come out and enjoy live comedy when you can. It's great, it's a good time, and uh, that's about it. Thank you. Can you do solos? <laughs> in there? And with that show, would that work? We, let's have, yeah, let's have a chat, like because anything can happen here. Yeah, yeah. My carburetor's not the only one that overheats from time to time here. Okay. It's safe, folks. Nothing to see. So this guy doesn't want me to introduce him. Um, I don't know why, but if you'd like to say hi, you can. Please don't kill me. Hey, how you doing? I'm Las Vegas Rocky. How you guys doing out there? We're doing great. <laughs> so how did Paul get you to come to this? Uh, I'm supporting my friend Mark Roman. We're both in a show together at the MGM, Peter's Madhouse. Awesome. Well, I look forward to seeing you tonight. And any final words for the audience? Hey, yo, Adrian. Give me a call. You heard it. So we're here with the Grand Girls. Can I get you to introduce yourselves tonight, please? Hi, I'm Julie. Hi, I'm Nicole. Hi, I'm Bree. And Paul was lucky enough to have the show here at the Grand. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the venue? Um, well, actually, um, we're, we just got here at the Mob Bar. Um, is it at the Art Bar or the Mob Headliner bar? tonight. You just killed it. You, you really knocked it out of the park tonight. Thank you, uh, thank nice. you so much for being here. Uh, but why don't you introduce yourself and uh, tell the crowd who you are. Hi, I'm Mark Patrick. Been doing this for about 15 years. Live here in Vegas. So come out and see me. In October, I'll be at Brad Garrett's MGM in Bally's, so you can check me out there. How, how did you like performing for a, a, a stand-up crowd? You know, no no seating in the back. I mean, it was just a great room. You know, I have to be. I have to admit, I, I was I was amazed because I've performed here before in the room adjoining this, and the crowd was 60 people. So I didn't know what to expect when I got here, and it was awesome. You know, I just like I, the energy it was just amazing. I couldn't wait to get up there. So it was everything I had hoped more than I hoped actually. You did a great job. Thank you for the laughs. I really appreciated oh, you coming out. Thank you very much. Thank You're you. Welcome. I'm here with Lance, but can you introduce yourself? I'm Lance Montalto. I'm one of the comedians opening for Paul tonight. Great. How did you get to know Paul? Uh, actually, I was just booked by an agent. I've never actually met him tomorrow. I'll, I will meet him tonight. <laughs> Excellent. Excellent. Uh, what are you looking forward to most? Uh, the check. That's always a good thing. Well, thank you so much for coming out tonight. And uh, any last words for the audience? Uh, you guys just have a lot of fun. I'm funny. What's going on? So we were kept safe tonight by the sheriff who's in town here. Uh, so uh, any any words of advice for the audience out there? Yeah, I just want to know, is this going to be on America's Funniest Home Videos? Because uh, I love that show. <laughs> I love John Stamos. <laughs> so uh, how did you like performing to a full crowd, standing room only? Yeah, well, uh, it's uh, less of a performance, more of a duty when you do it every day, sir. Yeah, yeah just, you know, I'm trying to keep, you know, America safe because, you know, we got the ISIS. You know what right. I mean? We got the Ebola. Yes, you know, dangerous. Of course, the NFL. That's the biggest threat of all, at least for right. the lady folk and stuff. <laughs> Not to mention anybody that has a head. N n now, uh, questions are nasty business. What, was it a little cold out there tonight? Is that why we have the uh, leg warmers? Uh, those are uh, tactical leg warmers, and thank you for asking. Uh, although, you know, point of order, Your Honor, uh, you know, they were kind of a, a freebie from Wayne Enterprises. Kind of a gotcha. don't ask, don't tell type of a situation if you grasp the undercarriage of my meaning. <laughs> I understand. Well, thank Copy you. that. <laughs> thank you so much for coming out tonight. It was a great show, and uh, I appreciated your contribution. Thanks, brother. This is not going to be on the TMZ, is it? Because, uh, Harvey, I'm coming for you, Harvey. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> you stood me up in that poker game. I really, I, I don't appreciate that, Carvey. I thought you were a nicer man than that. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> dangle out. <laughs>